23 verse 4 promises us that we have a shepherd who is well able to bring us through any darkest valleys. Yesterday we found out how the shepherd's rod and staff protected the sheep in the fields. But how about the sheep in the churches? Let's take a look again at those Hebrew words for a rod and a staff. Now, Shabbat and Mishineth both have a context of tools to be used protecting and caring for the woolies. However, there is also a context to both these words which can apply to the sheep of God's flock. First, let's take a look at the rod Shabbat. Another context for this word is of a scepter which would symbolize a ruling authority. The book of Judges, chapter 5, verse 14, tells us about tribal leaders responding to a rally call from Jerusalem. From Zebulun came those who carry a commander's Shabbat. Friends, our shepherd, who is Jehovah God Almighty, has the authority to protect and defend us from any kind of evil the devil wants to attack us with. Then we have the Mishineth, or the staff. Throughout the Old Testament, God used a staff to divide the Red Sea, bring water from a rock, and was a symbol of God's power in the hands of Moses. So how can God's Shebet and Mishineth help you today? How, how can God's authority and power protect you from the darts of the devil as you walk through a darkest valley? Let this promise from Psalm 23 of God's provision and protection give you comfort in your life. Mm -hmm.